There's a bunch of different communities you can choose uh, coming out of Naval Academy, whether it be Marines uh, or the Navy side. So SWO would be, I guess, conventionally what you think of the Navy as. SWO, it stands for Surface Warfare Officer. And we send the aircraft carriers, we send the, the ships out, and so it's the people in charge of running and operating those ships. We don't know exactly what job we'll, we have until we get to the ship, depending on what they need, but that's just kind of another part of the process is just figuring it out as we go along. If you get selected SWO, they'll put you into a matrix of where your pick is. So we're ranked from the day we get here. They rank us off of grades, even athletics, being a part of a varsity sport helps. They take into account your honor, your aptitude, your conduct, your peers rank you, your company officer ranks you, you get ranked within your teams. So there's a lot of constant just evaluation of you, but ultimately for nights like tonight is when you kind of get to step out and like see where you compare with others and hopefully you get you know what you've been working for these past four years. Off that ranking you'll go just like a kind of like a fantasy draft one to 226 and there'll be a big draft board up in Alumni Hall which is our basketball court. Everyone tonight will choose a ship and we'll go and serve on them for a two-year commitment. One positive thing a lot of people say is no matter where you're going there's gonna be a beach somewhere. Congratulations to all you future surface warfare officers. I could not possibly be prouder of you than I am right now. It's a great night. It's a great night, and you know it's kind of like uh, it's kind of like the ultimate draft. Only really, it's a little bit different because instead of the teams picking the individuals, the individuals are picking the teams tonight. If I was the first guy, and I could pick anything. I'd probably take uh, a ship out of San Diego. I really want to get back to the West Coast in San Diego. And what's even better? is while in some drafts there are teams that perhaps go 1-15, and 15, not that we'll mention any names, but the reality of it is every team here is undefeated. Let's start building our destiny. Let's start defining ourselves for the future. Congratulations, everybody. I look forward to talking to all of you. Bishop of Condi selects USS Rafael Peralta. The day in and day out military lifestyle it's definitely been hard and that's something I think that's why it's such a big deal tonight is that we're almost to the last step of graduating and becoming officers so tonight's just really a cool night to reflect but also be excited for our new journey. Really happy with where I wanted to go you know I kind of kind of wanted to go west coast go out to San Diego and uh, got what I wanted so happy at the end of the day looking forward to the uh, next stage of this. It's good to know I'll be going after graduation. I look forward, and, and all of my shipmates look forward to welcoming you out into the fleet, the best fleet that has ever sailed on the face of the earth.